Zael! Zael! Zael, I understand how you feel, but now we need to get out of here alive. Don't throw your life away. You owe it to both of them. We have to get back to the castle and let everyone know the war's over. Let's go home, Zael. Everyone's waiting for us. Hey everybody, Orfeola's here. Welcome back to some more of the last story. Last time, we had to put an end to Daggerin. In the final fight, that took like forever. This time, we gotta make our escape from this place. In the finale part two. Because there's probably gotta be more. Don't look back, okay? I know it's difficult, but we have to press on. We have no other choice. Zael, Mirani is right. You owe it to Dagon. So you have to survive, no matter what. Yes. It was Dagon's final order. That applies to you too, Saran. Yeah, I know. Come on then. Let's get out of here. Alright, we gotta make our way out. Zangorak. Too many lives have been lost. Both Gorak and human. Yeah. Had about enough of this war. Well, I think this might be the final stretch, so let's go make our way out of here. Final stretch. Man. I don't know what to say, folks. Don't know what to say. The end of this game is here. But, oh wait, I remember who's up ahead. You lot go on ahead. I'm gonna take him home. Seren, wait. You can't do it on your own. That's suicide. Shut up! I have to do this! Can't you see? There's no point anymore. He's gone and left me here. How can I go on living? Light. Oh, what's up, chaps? No. Up we go. Oh, <laughs> that really hurts. So, Dagrim. Yeah. I see. It must have been tough. It was. Zale. Well, we are running really fast right now. Well, looks like we gotta make our way out of this place. Okay, this spot. It's starting to fall apart. Let's get out of here before it's too late. If we don't hurry, we're finished. Wait up, guys! Wait up, you guys are going a whole lot faster than me. Why am I not going any faster? Holy crap! Should I be like at least a little bit even than you? Holy crap, you guys. Talk about Olympic sprinters. Is it really falling? Oh crap, it is falling, it is falling. Get out of here, get out of there. The exit should be above. Not much further. Keep your guard up. We don't know what surprises await us. Something will try to defend the outsider. I just know it. Golems! They're hell-bent on destroying us. I'm not about to lose to one of these things. Zane, don't be rash. Try to stick together, everyone. 
Look out for the pillars from above too. Yeah, so pretty much just keep in the middle. Yeah, I really don't want to do any jumping. Well, I guess we could do some sniping. Or not. But yeah, those pillars are kind of intimidating, saying, uh, no thanks, I don't really want to get out of here. Ow. Come on, Marania. This is, this is past the final boss. This should be easy if we took down Dagrin. Well, you can get out of here. Anybody else? Nope, looks like that guy's gone. No, sir. Who's left? I think that might be it. No. Nope. You little golems, get out of here. Are you done yet? I think that might be it now. Not yeah, it looks now. like it. Good. Everyone's okay. Yes. So, let's go. It was all over. The Gorak retreated to their own continent. Thanks to the continued efforts of Zael and his friends, a treaty of peace was signed, bringing an end to the war for good. It was decided that Fortress Island should stay joined to the edge of Lazarus Island, so Zael moved them to a new position, in between the Empire and the Gorak continent. The war that had plagued both nations was over, and the land's energy was no longer being drained away. With each day that went by, the comforting warmth of peace spread softly across the land. Soon enough, the time came to return the outsider to the sky. So, we have a couple people to talk to. What about you two? So, now Lazarus is the bridge between two great nations, eh? I bet this city is going to become even more prosperous than it already was. Why don't we start up a business here or something? People would appreciate it. You? Running a respectable business? Well, there's got to be something that's right up our street. How about... A bar. You'll have guzzled all the booze before the punters can get their hands on it. <laughs> Shut up. In a way, that is kind of true. Well, it could be fun. Uh, glad to see you're back, Lowell. Yeah, just so you guys know, Lowell is kind of my favorite character in the game. What about you two? It's not going to be easy for the humans in Garak to live together in harmony. Not after all those years of conflict. No. Just as the energy of the land will not simply return as though it was never lost. But with time, I believe that things will improve. Zale, you made the right choice. Sorry about the little cut there, but we only have one thing left. Callista. Shall we return the outsider to the sky from whence it came? Yes, let's begin. Everything's ready. It's time for us to grant the Outsider's wish. My family's right can finally be fulfilled. Let's send the Outsider home. Yes.
Thank you all. You have granted us the freedom you so desired. Now we can once more gather the energy that fills the far reaches of the cosmos and use it to create new worlds. Thank you. The Outsider is a world seed, a being that drifts through the darkness, absorbing the surrounding energy. It only brought destruction because it was summoned down here, to a place where it should never have been. The Outsider belongs in the skies, a seed of new life. So the Outsider creates new life? Yes. I believe that it will now. That mark is a gift that the outsider granted to you. That bond will not disappear. Thus, the conflict surrounding the outsider after centuries of tragedy and strife was finally brought to an end. The draining of the land was halted, and as for the heroes Zael and Lady Callista, the tale of how they and their companions brought peace to the land would be passed down for many generations to come. A few days after the outsider's departure, humans and Garak alike had chosen to work together sharing their technologies with one another, and their combined efforts had begun to clear away the scars of destruction that tainted their homes.